I know deep down in my home, my cousin didn't kill that cop. He did not kill that cop. No disrespect to his family, but I just find it a little irritating to, to have reported on the news that I got the wrong guy and, and this is a perfect child. Sheriff Newell Norman says Detective David Michelle Jr. was making a pedestrian stop Wednesday and attempting to handcuff 19-year-old Jermaine Nevo. That's when he's accused of shooting Michelle three times. Nevo immediately flipped around and went chest to chest with Deputy Michelle and reached over Deputy Michelle with the gun that he pulled from his waistband and fired the first shot. I don't understand how you tell me he was face to face with a cop. He pulled a gun on a man bigger than him and reached over him and shoot him in the back? Come on, come on, make sense to me. None of this makes sense. However, the sheriff says Nevo gave a confession. The same kid that says he doesn't want to get in trouble for probation, so he's going to kill a deputy. I know he didn't do this. It's not him. Nevo's cousin, Chandrell Lede, says his mother has not been able to see him. No one's saying anything. We don't know if he's living, breathing, nothing. She says they worry what condition he's in after being arrested by police. The sheriff says video given to them by a witness shows officers surrounding Nevo when he was apprehended in a neighbor's backyard. We see about 12 cops around my, my cousin, beating him senseless, taking turns, beating him. And I, and, and I get, you know, the problem with the video. I get it. We're, we're, and, and we're going to investigate that, and I get all of this. We hadn't even got to the funeral. It's a little bit of a slippery slope. I got it. Now, the sheriff says during interviews with investigators, Nevo admitted having a stolen gun, and Nevo was previously arrested in New Orleans, charged with possession of a stolen firearm. He was set to go to court on that charge this coming Monday. Adriana. All right, thanks so much, Casey.